Ladies and gentlemen, when I show you these incredibly handsome gentlemen and female on the screen, you just think, wow, they have been caught at their absolute prime. It does not get any better looking than Lee's lot here. They have absolutely outdone themselves. They've got their cheekbones, their makeup. Everyone's even looking at the camera except Alexis. He's just clearly a bit off. He said, what do these legends all have in common? Well, 10 most wanted fugitives, the official top 10 fugitives maintained on the FBI website. What I wanted to do though, I just when I came across this image of such sensual human beings all clearly at the top of their game and you know extremely great humane individuals, why don't we have a look? When I first came across this, number one is a, j a lady called Ruya. Oh, look, that's how you, you can download a poster. Christ. Look at this. FBI top 10 most wanted. We got a Ruya. She's wanted for fraud, money laundering, conspiracy to commit securities, Damn, this, this lady is absolutely the worst. So she's Bulgaria. 1980. Where's she? What, what has she actually done? You know, it's busy to travel with armed guards. My God, she's serious. She might have had plastic surgery. Bro, she's gone full, like, plastic surgery mode. She's hiding. 250 Gs, homies. Let's find this woman here. Look, she's she's uh, been basically done. Oh, my God. A large-scale fraud scheme starting from 2014. She's basically robbed people from what? Oh, she's like crypto shit. Okay scumbag. Like, she could be anywhere. She's Sofia, Bulgaria, Greece, Eastern Europe. Damn, imagine being the top 10 wanted person and all you did was wire fraud. Let's let's have a look at Wilver. Wilver, I mean, uh, bloody hell, he's melting. He's literally melting like a popsicle in the sun and that right picture is like necks broken. Too much cocaine by the look of it. But this man is Colombian, which is very racist of him. Very racist of him. He's not trying to beat stereotypes. He's just gone straight for it, whatever. Five million bucks! Fuck yeah, dude, I'm gonna go find this bloke. Colombia, Venezuela. So basically, he's a drug dealer. Mate, five million smackaroonies. Five million voucher. Can you? Five million. Five million bucks for this man right here. How's no one found him? 190 pounds. Oh, Christ. He's born in 1981. He's like 40, bro. Fair dues, drug dealer. He's wearing Nike and a little bit of feeler. Oh, look at this guy. FBI want my feedback. I feel like just by being on this website, I'm giving them all my details, but it's worth it for the vid bro it's worth it for them for them beautiful oh my god hostaging hostaging <laughs> this man stole someone two million bucks again two million smackaroos who did he steal 17 christian missionaries holy fuck how did he do that he stole 17 people and kept them for 61 days holy shit he killed a u.s citizen as well well yeah look i'm gonna go try find this bloke give me five seconds yeah no i couldn't see him mission failed We'll get him next time. But he's in Haiti. He's, um, I, I don't know what else to say. Let's find this skull. Why am I doing this? What the hell? But yeah, mate, I'm just stealing 17 people. That's crazy. Man, that's fucking nuts. Arnaldo, what a name. Arnaldo Jimenez. What's Arnaldo done? He looks like the guy out of Breaking Bad who, like, sells them the caravan. That's what this guy's done. Texas, what's he done? 250 Gs. Ah, it's not worth me time. I've got a 5 million one. Bro, if you actually found that 5 million guy, you'd be pretty set for life, wouldn't you? May have fled to Mexico. He's frequent Mexico or Illinois. How, you know what I mean? Like, hmm, he could be Illinois or he could be Mexico. They're certainly making our job a lot easier as uh, bounty hunters. That's what we are, isn't it? Can you be a bounty hunter? Oh my God. Killed his wife the day after their wedding. Holy shit. Bro's literally got away with it. How much is this guy worth? 200. Oh, he's literally committed murder. Killed his wife. He's only 250 Gs. Holy fuck. Frick. Gee, so he killed her, stabbed her in the bathroom the day after their wedding. Well, let's find out what Big Donald's done. You know, you can't avoid that moustache there. Christ, look at his face in that one. It's like a handlebar. What's he done? He's a tree trimmer. He trims trees. 250 Franklin movies, casinos, and has travelled to Florida in the past. Something for allegedly, oh, sex trafficking. At least one ch I mean, let's be real, though. If you're going to have a guess what he'd done, I think child trafficking would probably not be far off my top two. 250 Gs, bro. You should be able to, like, like bring him in hot or cold. I can bring him in hot or I can bring him in cold. I can bring him in warm. Jesus Christ. Where, where is he hiding? He's in fucking Missouri or Kentucky. How can you not find someone in your own country? Look at this guy. This guy's not even at fucking puberty yet. What's he done? Got to turn up to fucking geography class. What's he doing? We've seen crossing into Mexico may reside in San Francisco de los Romos. They just stole San Francisco's name there. Oh my God. He's allegedly involved in the murder of a co-worker. Where was he born? 1998. He's three years older than me. Jesus. Killed a co-worker. A co-worker. He's like a baby. 
Look at this guy. What's he done? Try say that. Go on. I, I, I dare you. Bad Resh Kumar. Done it. Nailed it. Unlawful flight to avoid prosecution. First degree murder. Second degree murder. First degree assault. Second degree assault. Dangerous weapon. Intent to injure. Holy shit. Killed his wife. As they were working at a donut shop. <laughs> Not funny. He died. Just at the fact they worked at a donut shop together. Holy shit. Holy hell. Killed her in a donut shop. He must have jammed her. Well, that's like South Park level. I wonder where he's hiding. How do these people get away with it? Look at this guy. Fuck me. He's wanted for stealing all the fucking McDonald's fries. Jesus Christ. Unlawful flight to avoid murder. Fuck you, look at that picture there. 300 pounds. Christ, have you not found him? Don't need a bloody pair of binoculars to locate this guy. Jesus Christ, mate. Legend murder, outdoor shopping centre, California, several rounds, automatic handgun, strike him in the head and causing his death. Yeah, fucking do that to you, Jesus. I suppose I should be so shocked that these are like wanted for such heinous crimes, considering it's the FBI's top 10 wanted. I think that's all of them. No, this guy looks scary. Holy shit. Yulan Adonoi Achaga Karias. Fucking hell. No wonder he can't be found. He's got 25 names. Uh, five mil. You know this guy's serious when he's five mil. Obviously, you don't want to do crime and be a bad person and hurt people, but I think if I read online that I was wanted for five mil, you'd be like, holy shit. Mama made. I'm a fucking big deal. I am a big fucking deal. Cocaine. Racketeering. <laughs> Possession. Who's that? Shut up. Sorry, it's just my phone's vibrating. Someone's just scared a girl. Criminal activity in Honduras, providing re MS-13 enterprise in Central United Firearms, narcotics, cash. Dude, this guy's serious. Oh, who the fuck? Sorry, lads. Me bloody dog's calling me. He wants his lunch. He's not having it. He fucking... I'm busy. Just a joke, obviously. I feed my dog. Fire right, This guy's a big deal, bro. He's wanted for firearms, narcotics. You notice all these people are hiding in Brazil or Mexico? It was Mexico. Sorry, that's racist. Only speaks Espanol. See, I'd love to be able to find one of these guys. Five million smackaroos for hiding. Porky. His nickname's Porky. <laughs> Look, lads, Karius is on the free. I'm making this video to spread awareness. I'm just such a good United States citizen, but I'm an Englishman, you know what I mean? I am literally the best guy ever. Oh, my God. Who's the most wanted person in 2010? Oh. 2011? Oh. Oh. I was hoping to see, like, who the um, most wanted person. But, yeah, look at these guys. Keep your eyes peeled, lads, especially if you live in Mexico. I was just kind of thought there'd be... Um, yeah, I don't know why I did this. Why have we done this? We're spreading awareness. We're the good guys. I'm Vengeance. I'm Batman. I'm literally creating a new environment to help people. But yeah, God bless. Good night. Oh, good luck. Holy hell. But yeah, let's find these. Let's find these criminals. Grr, justice, vengeance. I'm going to put on my cape and cowl. It's a key rain is pouring down.